It's like this guy invented a new scheme. Ricardo Perez was fired from an actual dealership, but kept the title as salesman to prey on customers over and over again. He's working all kinds of different angles. Yeah, absolutely. He's every angle he can cut. He's doing it. Ricardo Perez, quite the used car salesman. The 38 year old fired last July from Dick Scott, a dealership in Plymouth, but he kept the title and his contact list to blindside dozens of them. We have at least four as of right now uh, from Lincoln Park. Lincoln Park Police Chief Ray Waters says there are 30 victims in counting. Allen Park, Lincoln Park, Southgate, uh, Taylor, Macomb County, it, it stretches all over the place. The scheme goes like this. Perez, posing as a salesman with Dick Scott, offered lease pull-aheads or to take an old ride off someone's hands and get them into something new. Instead of meeting at the dealership, he used being COVID safe to his advantage, meeting customers in parking lots to make the exchange. He'd end up reselling their car, never returning it to Dick Scott. And in return, he'd either resell the customer Customer, another vehicle he'd stolen or he would actually go to dealerships and get vehicles but and put them in their names sign all the paperwork then he'd tell them their payments are less than the actual dealership was charging what he was telling them was that uh, the first three months were waived so then they wouldn't find out until months later that they were actually behind on a payment. Those late payment notices people are receiving now, sending them in droves to local police departments, all alleged victims of Perez. The crazy thing is, is that most of it was word, by, word of mouth. At some point, he must have been a successful salesman for people to trust him. Even the dealership, Dick Scott, a victim here. The reason Perez was fired was fraud and theft. Perez charged in Lincoln Park Thursday and will be shipped around to police stations all over, racking up charges along the way. We do have some of the vehicles that we were able to return back to some people. Um, you know, we're trying our best to work with those people because they are absolutely 100% the victims of this. If you think that you're a victim, call your local police department. All of the agencies involved so far are sharing information to build cases against Perez. Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.